All right, hey, what's up guys, it's Roy here. And with today's video, I'm gonna be doing an unboxing and review of this laptop stand that was sent to me from a company called Quintus. So without further ado, let's dive right into it. All right, so with this laptop stand here, this is an aluminum alloy style laptop stand that's going to be able to give you your uh, laptop mount and also a phone mount, which is actually pretty nice, um, but it is an aluminum alloy. It does say that the max load is 10 kilograms. So according to Amazon, uh, it can fit up to 22 pounds, which is plenty of weight for any laptop basically. Uh, it does say here that it will fit from a 10 inch to a 17 inch laptop. Um, so with my gaming laptop that I have over here, uh, we'll be able to you know, test that out and see if it works. Um, now this is only $40.99 on Amazon with Prime Shipping right now. If you do want to buy it after watching this video, they were kind enough to give me a 15% off coupon code for any of my viewers. So if you want to follow my link uh, down in the description, you are able to put that coupon code in and get an extra 15% off. Um, so let's go ahead and dive into this box real quick and let's see what we get with the actual unboxing experience. So as far as the uh, laptop stand box, as you can see here, pretty generic, says laptop stand here, compatible with 10 to 17 inch, like I said. Got a pretty good idea of what it looks like here. And like I said here, it says aluminum alloy, 10 kilograms. Here on the bottom, it's just kind of like a little barcode here, so nothing special. And then here on the back, uh, you do have a little bit of a breakdown of how to adjust the laptop stand. So you got your initial position, and then you can adjust the height of the stand and the angle of the stand, as you can see here. So it is kind of nice because it is not necessarily a stand-up type of stand where you are able to like stand up. Now, maybe you could, I guess, if you had it on a higher desk, uh, but it at least is going to be able to give you some uh, pretty high viewing angles, which is kind of nice, actually. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and get this bad boy opened up here. So as far as getting this open, let's get that open here. And as you can see, this is kind of how it looks in the packaging. So pretty simple. So you have, let's see here, just some little styrofoam cushions on here. Get that thrown away. And here it is. So it's actually pretty small. Um, I mean, you know, it's not huge or anything, but it's got this uh, very nice aluminum alloy feel to it. Uh, as you can see here, it just looks really good. Uh, you have a, a Quintus logo there, which uh, you got the Q that looks like the power logo. And then the I looks like the battery there. So that's kind of cool. You have these uh, four little uh, cushion pads, little rubber mat pads here that will keep your laptop in place. And then they do have some little rubber pads here where your uh, laptop will rest. And then you just literally just lift it up. Now it's pretty force, uh, forceful guys. Like, so what I mean by that is like, it's very hard to lift and that's a good thing. You don't want it super flimsy or anything like that whenever you're uh, trying to use this for your laptop. So you want it to be very tight, very snug. So that way it's just not collapsing on you once you put your laptop on here. So as you can see here, um, this is kind of the way it looks right here. So whenever you have it lifted up, these hinges are very uh, snug. And then, like I said, you are able to put your laptop here and then a smartphone here. And as far as a smartphone goes, you just lift this portion up and uh, let me go ahead and grab my uh, Pixel 4 here. And as you can see, I can just kind of set it right there. And that's kind of how it looks, you know, so you have um, you know, you can do a landscape mode. You probably, I guess, could technically do it in uh, portrait mode as well, as long as you have this lifted up a little bit higher. But as you can see here with this circular cutout here, uh, you're not gonna have any issues. Now, one thing you can do is slide uh, the phone um, holder here. So as you can see over the overhead shot, uh, you have a, a screw. So you have a little bolt here that you are able to twist and tighten if you wanted it to be a little bit further away from your laptop, depending on the angle that you wanted to drop it down to. Um, but overall, so far, my initial impressions is that it feels very well made. 
Um, you never can tell sometimes when you look at these on Amazon, uh, you know, I'm always a little leery um, because, you know, with you elevating your laptop up like this, uh, sometimes I'm a little concerned that it will just fall and collapse. But just from how hard it is to actually open up, it's really showing me how strong these hinges are, how tight it is. Uh, and you can't loosen or tighten them by any means. So, you know, you are stuck with uh, kind of how they came from uh, the factory. Uh, at the bottom, you do have uh, some rubber pads there that are gonna allow uh, the laptop stand to not really scooch around on your tabletop here. Uh, so that's also really nice. So I do like that a lot as well. Uh, so let me go ahead and grab my laptop real quick. Uh, I have a 17, or excuse me, I have a 15.6 inch uh, Acer Nitro uh, gaming laptop. And even though it's 15.6 inches, it is fairly big. It's bigger than probably most 17 inch laptops. If you just bought like a generic laptop, it's about the same size almost. Um, so let's go ahead and grab it and slap it on real quick. All right, guys, so I've got my Acer Nitro 5 gaming laptop here. So like I said, this one is a 15.6 inch laptop. Uh, but like I said, it's not your normal 15.6 inch laptop. It's got a little bit of weight to it. Uh, but you got these big giant fans on the bottom. So obviously with a gaming laptop, you want it to be uh, cooling off constantly so it's not getting overheated or anything. But with this type of uh, laptop stand having this hollowed out area here, um, it's going to help be able to continue on that cooling of the laptop and not interfere with that. So it's not gonna make my laptop overheat. So let's go ahead and slap on the laptop real quick and see how it does. So first things first, I put it on, it feels very sturdy. I'm pushing down on it and it's not really moving. And like I said, this gaming laptop is fairly heavy. Um, one thing that you do wanna make sure you do though, is actually make sure that you have this angled. So as you can see here, I have this angled a little bit more down and have this a little bit for, uh, more flat um, because if you had it uh, super duper high, for example, so let's say for example, I had it set up like this, this would be fine because it's you know pretty flat. So it's still got this 90 degree, um, or not really 90 degrees, but I mean like it's a flat surface um, so when it's like this, it's okay. But one thing that you will notice is as soon as I open up the laptop screen, see how it tends to fall backwards there a little bit. So if I would have let it go, it would have completely fell back. So you want to make sure that you're angling the laptop stand the right way. And all you got to do is really to fix this problem is just to really push it down. So that way the heavier of the weight is going forward. So when you open up the laptop screen, it's not gonna wanna fall backwards. So that's a little tip, guys, that you do not want to make a mistake on and throw your laptop on here and have it all angled goofy and then boom, it falls backwards. You do not want that. So with this, uh, like I say, you just wanna angle it down just a tad bit so that way you got a nice little area here. And now I'm able to do my laptop. I can do my typing and all that here. I do still have access uh, to uh, my phone stand here, so I'm able to put my phone here if I wanted to put it in landscape mode. If I did want to do portrait mode, then all you got to do is, like I said, just uh, loosen that up, scooch it a little bit further away from the actual laptop, and then now I have it in portrait mode. Um, and then, of course, I could probably angle this up just a tad bit um, so that way it's not resting exactly on top of my phone. So now I can have it sitting like this, where now it is literally, um, you know, I got everything staring at me. I have my phone staring at me in portrait mode. I got my laptop here and I'm sitting upright. So I'm not having to slouch down and look at my uh, laptop looking down like this. So it does help quite a bit. Uh, more than likely, most people are gonna have their phone in um, landscape mode, um, but who knows? I mean, maybe they're wanting to watch a movie while they're you know doing some work on their laptop or whatever maybe watching their favorite youtuber watch you know do this stuff uh so anyways um so yeah so not a bad laptop guys uh laptop stand i mean this is pretty nice i i actually really like it because like i said it feels very well made and for it being under 40 bucks you know or 40 less 15 percent now uh, if you use my coupon code 
Uh, this laptop stand feels very, very good. Um, it, like I said, it just looks very good. Uh, you just gotta make sure that when you're using it, that you're angling it the right way. So that way the weight isn't gonna be pushing it back when you just do decide to open it. Um, but for the most part, guys, I mean, it looks very nice. I mean, it looks very well made, feels very good. Once I have the laptop on here, it's not wanting to scooch with those rubber pads, uh, you know, really holding uh, my table here. So would I recommend this laptop stand? Absolutely, I would recommend this laptop stand. And I've come across a handful of laptop stands, guys, that I've bought that are absolute junk. And a lot of times it's just because I was trying to buy something on a budget. So maybe I was looking for one that was 10 or 15 bucks on Amazon and maybe it had five stars or, or four stars. But at the end of the day, I understand that a lot of people are getting paid to make those five star reviews on Amazon, which is a big no, no, don't do that because they're going to mislead a lot of people. But for this, if you're looking to spend around 35 to 40 bucks after shipping and taxes with my coupon code, I think this will fit the bill guys, because this would look really cool if you wanted like a dual monitor set up in your uh, house. So I could scooch this monitor over, put this over here, and then now I can open it up. And then I would have, you know, this monitor and then this monitor playing. So that's just something to think about, you know, but if you want to use it on the go, for example, uh, it is very uh, slim and a very, you know, low profile um, because at the end of the day, like I said, you know, if you uh, squish that down, well, let's say, let's close that all the way, fold that down, fold this down, which guys, this is very stiff. Now you have a pretty fairly portable laptop stand. Like I said, it's aluminum, feels very well made, looks good, looks nice, um, but this can easily slide into anyone's backpack or anything like that if you're looking to, uh, like I said, take a, a portable laptop stand uh, on the go. So there you have it, guys. There is the Quintus laptop stand for any 10 to 17 inch laptop. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you loved it, I would really appreciate a subscription and ring that notification bell for up-to-date content. I do post videos at least once a week, so hopefully you do keep on coming back for more and check out my other videos that I've posted over the last year. And uh, yeah, be safe out there, God bless, and we'll see you on the next one.